Welcome to more Call of Duty World at War, everybody. Alrighty, so last time, wait, where's some stuff? I can't find them. Get out of here. Last time, we uh, actually ended up clearing two of the four mortars, I believe, which is actually pretty good progress for sure. Um, did I kill everybody? I believe I did. I'm gonna shoot that thing. Alright, so, I'm gonna get this carbine over here. We're gonna die. What? Okay, he died. Is that a... It was a person, I wasn't sure. I'm doing it. One sec. Uh, another grenade, I'm not gonna move for a while because I heard it. Okay. I suppose I can move now. Dude, get over here. Alright, you're dead. Alright, so I'm not sure if this will be the finale. Probably not. Probably not, and the biggest reason why is because there's still gonna be credits and all. Like, there's two more missions. I'm almost done with this one, I think. So I'm pretty sure there's gonna be eight videos. Get out of here. What the hell? Why did it give me the alert again? Is it every time that you, like, reload the game it does that? Probably. I didn't really know that. Okay. So... I guess I need to go this way, apparently. Okay, we're nearly there. Please should be on route. It's over here. Any guns? I don't see any really. Stay alert. Flank around both sides. Clear every corner of this courtyard. Clean up the So I am low on ammo, as you can clearly see. So I must be aware of what to do next. Switch to another weapon, probably. Yeah, the auto aim doesn't actually work from super, super far. I'm just saying. Oh god. Somebody else shot me from way over here as well, but... Whatever. Okay, I need to switch to something else. Aerosock a bayonet? Sure, why not? Actually, no, that's stupid. I need to switch to a machine gun. But I can't find any. Oh my god, I'm so bad with this weapon. Oh god. That is so gruesome. Yeah, man, this game was really well noted for having some very crazy visuals compared to other Call of Duties that were released at the same time. They're not even shooting at me. Why not? What the hell? Are they like glitch or something? Okay. It all seems to be clear now. They're all Arasakas. There's no machine guns. Oh wait, here's a machine gun. I will take that gladly. I see some ammo right there. Okay. More ammo. Perfect. Okay, we're good. Where are we going? This way. Shh. Sasha. Shadows. Take aim. Open fire! Miller! Man that MG! What MG? Clear the area! Oh, this one. Oh shoot, that's a friendly. Alright, just go ahead and keep spamming shots. This thing does eventually overheat though, be aware of that. You can always tell by looking at the bottom right corner. Okay, it all seems to be good now, for the most part. Go ho, yeah, go ahead. Shoot those Private Joyal. Oh, 
Lots of dead people everywhere. Okay, I just need to probably rush here. I'm just shooting a bunch of barrels too, just, I don't know, it seems to be working for the most part. Okay, I hear grenades everywhere, I'm not going to move for a little while, hold on. Okay. Grenade behind me. Exploded. There we go. Simple enough. Let's keep going. It feels like we're just doing like a big circle around. Oh my god. Wait. Oh yeah, there we go. Now this right here, I actually took the least better option, I guess you can say. You can actually choose who you want to save in that situation. You can choose to save Private Polanski, or you can choose to save Sergeant Roebuck. Um, it depends on the actions. It's a little harder to save Sergeant Roebuck because there are actually two people crowding around him. Oh my god. How do I, where do I take cover here? Like, seriously. I might actually die. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. Uh, yeah, but um, it's like I was saying, it is a little bit harder to save Roebuck. But even then, it's not like it's hard or anything. But yeah. Bomb it. Oh my god. Oh damn, that's friendly. Please bomb him, please bomb him. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. I died. Because um, I actually was holding the controller with only one hand in that second. Because I had like I had to scratch my face, and then of course that happens on that same second. Unbelievable! Just my luck, right? Just my luck. God, I can't even shoot anybody though. I think was that a f I don't know. I don't know. I'm, I'm entirely sure. Oh Jesus Christ, man! Nice. I'm waiting to see where the freaking kamikaze people are, man. Or whatever they're called. What the hell? Do you see this? Do you see how many people just charged at them? Also, why are they shooting that way? 
Do we have friendlies on that side? Okay, I can't even see. What is the east building? That one? Well, it's gotta be. I mean, if you just look east on the map, you know? This, at least. Starting to run pretty long ammo for machine guns of all types. Wait, I think I just picked up more, never mind. Oh god, grenade. I'm not moving any closer though, man. This is too risky. Oh, damn, man. doing it. Shit, get out of the way. Okay, please be enough. Got it. Damn. We made it. We did it. It's over. Everything that was asked of us, we've done. Every night, we lay in a filthy foxhole praying the enemy won't slit our throats. Every day was spent crawling through the mud and the dirt while our bullets whistle all around. This is the enemy's last stand. When we take Shuri Castle, we go home. All of us. The Red Army encircles the Reichstag, the parliament building and final stronghold of the Fascist Reich. In the surrounding streets, we choke the life from those who will still dare to defend it. It is an honor and a privilege to play a part in this glorious battle. When our flag flies over the city, our enemies' defeat and humiliation will be beyond question. Our vengeance will be complete. You will be okay. Do you hear me? They flooded their own metro in an effort to kill us, Dimitri. But once again, they failed. Once more, we cheat death. You will be okay. Relax for a few minutes. Breathe deeply. Which do you think will lead us home? Writing about this war or fighting it? No one will ever read this! If you lack the stomach to kill for your country, at least show me that you are willing to die for it! Okay, a bunch of grenades everywhere in the beginning. Awesome. Oh my god, man. Okay, let me wait until his health refills. I'm just gonna charge to the left. Like an idiot, okay? Wait, what? That didn't even block. You know what, this time I'm just gonna run straight through. Like, I'm just gonna run. Because screw this shit. Okay, here we go. Get that stamina, run. Run. All the way. And 
just shoot a bunch of bullets everywhere. I don't even know. Oh, there's a dude up there too. I see him. That was really fast. See, if you just charge through sometimes, it works. God damn it. Another grenade again. Okay, you just fail that grenade throw, I'm just saying. That grenade just bounced off of something, and then, yeah, that was a fail. Oh my god. Shit. So many people. You know what? I'm just gonna reload this and then go full on ramble. Here we go. Wait, they're all dead. Except this guy. So far it's looking pretty easy. Not really, I mean there were a lot of enemies that almost killed us plenty of times as you may have already seen. Jesus. Okay. Shit, I killed my own friend. Friendly fire. I've done that so many times though man. Like it's crazy. How often I've actually done it. It's ridiculous. Dude hiding right there. There we go. Got him. Okay. We did it. Through the window. Go. Through the window? Sure. The main thing we got to get to that place, the heart. That is, I believe it's the capital building of Berlin. I'm not sure. I could be wrong. It's like the equivalent of the White House, maybe. That's what I'd like to say. I could be very wrong about that. I don't know my history about Germany. I should probably shut up then and not even say anything, right? Because what if somebody who's German is watching this, you know? They're probably going to be offended, like, oh, I'm so freaking ignorant. Which, they're right, in that sense. And I should, that's why I should shut up. Come on. Whatever. I just gotta keep charging, man. Now, I gotta plant explosives every one of these things. Which sometimes can be a little annoying, but I mean... I do not, I do not like this semi-automatic weapon. Probably my least favorite one in the whole game. Here is my favorite. I have to put the Garan, and then there's one more that I... Oh, the Carbine. Well, actually, I think I like the Carbine, the Carbine more than the Garan. And then the Garan, and then this one. Yeah, oh, so for some reason it feels like this dude runs out of ammo so quickly. Oh my god, there's so many coming. I'm out of ammo. I just need to need to charge them. I'm gonna do it. Wait, run more, run more, run more. That is gonna be very crazy. All right, so took out two. Not bad, not bad. I need a new weapon though. Oh shit. Okay, out of ammo. Wait, I got some more ammo for this weapon now. But I need to switch to something else. MP40? This will work. Pretty sure. Let's get some ammo here. Damn, they are very heavily fortified. Holy shit. Okay, gotta keep going. Oh no, I'm dead. That indicator was barely there. It was so 
so much of a distance and it still got me. That's unbelievable. What if I just charge into that building right now? No, actually that's dumb. That is very dumb, because I don't have any freaking... Give me this weapon. One sec. Okay, here we go. Damn it, that's not gonna work either. It's just too many. Seems I need to push somehow. Yeah, that's actually what happens, like... What you'll notice... Call of Duty is a lot different than a lot of other shooters, first-person shooters, because Call of Duty has many places where there's infinite enemies. So on Veteran, it's not really about taking your... I mean, okay, it is about taking your time, but at the same time, not taking your time infinitely. It's about knowing when to move forward, and people who have played Veteran Call of Duty know what I'm talking about. Like, if you keep... Like, if I keep staying here, let's say, in Veteran mode, like, yeah, I'm safe, you know, I'll kill an enemy, I go on danger, go like this again, wait. It'll take forever, of course. But eventually you'll realize that you can't advance. Like, you can't just kill all the enemies and be like, okay, I'm good now, no. They will keep spawning infinitely. Yeah, there will be a little bit less compared to the beginning, but it's about knowing when to advance. Because eventually you have to advance, you have to charge through. And that's, basically, veteran is all about that. Knowing when to move forward, because that's going to, um, like, it's going to dictate a lot, a lot of things for sure, you know? Turn in the AK, I'll take this. This is one of my favorite sounding uh, weapons in this game. Like how it sounds. Probably my is it my favorite. Oh shoot! I think it was outside. Yeah, it was. Probably my favorite bolt action rifle. Maybe I don't know. Even though I never really used it during the campaign, which is kind of ironic. Oh wait, these are friends. Okay, this is crazy. This is really crazy. I think I missed. Okay, so I need to plant explosives on those things. Oh my god. Okay. Yeah, see, like I keep saying, they're infinite. So we need to know when to move, and because it's the second to last level of the game. I need to be a little bit more decisive on... Holy shit. I'm taking so much damage. I just need to charge through. If I'm charging through, I'm taking the MP40, I'm just saying. Here we go. Wait, okay, let me kill that guy over there. That guy too. Okay, reload the weapon. Let's go. Okay. I'm gonna run up there that. Run back. Okay, now I need to support that left side over there. Here we go. Fourth one. Run. You know what? I want this one. There's a lot of this gun everywhere, I see it. Well, not that much, but... Actually, yes, there is. There's a lot. Okay, so I got a checkpoint, as you can see. Well, that's good. The hell? Okay, let's wait right here a little bit. Well, I mean, the thing is, there's people up there in the second floor. I need to be careful about this. What do I need to do? Enter the right stack. No. Stupid grenades, man. Okay, I'm gonna go up here to the second floor. See? There were people up here. I told you. Okay, come on guys, we need to advance. Come help me. What is this music? Oh 
let's snipe some people. Actually, I don't need to snipe. I'm close enough. Checkpoint reached. Eventually, I do need to make my way down there. And just, like, run forward, I think. Wait, no, I can go now. I can go. Hold on. Okay. Shit. You. Okay, you're dead. Wait, isn't there some... I need to trigger some... Hold on. I forgot. I'm not really sure what you need to do here. I need to enter the right stack somehow, some way. Take that back. You're we running forward. I can't need a new weapon. I'm just saying. What? I need a weapon. Keyword. I'll take that. Because I have a sniper as another one. That's not going to work, as you already know. Reznov is already at the front, so I think we can just keep going, right? Pretty sure. Wait, what do I do? Shit. Okay, we're all ready. Come on. I don't know what I need to do here. Maybe I need to take out the MGs, probably? I mean, maybe. Let me try. Hello, MG. You're dead. Oh, shit. Let's try taking out this guy, too. Did I get him? I don't know. I do not know. I Actually, yes. I'm pretty sure I got him. People keep shooting me from behind. Things, these are all friendlies. Oh my god. There we go, that's what's supposed to happen. See, I don't know what triggers that, but it happened. Oh, no! Our glorious victory has been a journey of blood and brutality. All of it has been necessary. When the flag of our motherland flies atop the Reichstag, all of Berlin will know that the evil of the fascist Reich has been wiped from the face of the earth. April 30th, 1945. When he first spoke of Dmitri, Reznov told tales of a hero. Someone we should all aspire to be like. At times, I have seen him show mercy, but at others act with complete brutality. I do not understand him. Perhaps heroes need not question their actions. Steal yourselves, men, for the final push to victory. Today, we crush what remains of their fascist right. As heroes, we will return to Russia's independence. Our land, our people. Our Your motherland needs your final commitment! Oh, he has this honor, God 
Defending this building will fight to their last breath. Just the last remnants of resistance, and this night our flag will fly over the city. Alright, so if you enjoyed this episode in any way, please be sure to leave a like, I would appreciate it very much, thank you, and I will see you all in the finale. Bye bye everyone, have a great day.